Hey guys, this is Sonia once again from TechPro360 and today in this video we are going to be talking about some pretty cool H-Pros modules you might want to check out. So if you are looking for something beyond the traditional ones like gravity box and so, do check this video. Before talking about modules, for those who don't know what Expose is, well, Expose is basically an app that lets you install several modules. Well, modules are like other apps you find in Play Store, but these apps lets you do system level changes without really changing the ROM. But one thing though, you do need root access to use these. And for the process of installing Expose, the link to the tutorial will be given in the description below. So, first up, Android N5. Keeping in mind that most of older smartphones won't be getting any official update to Google's latest version of Android, this one is pretty handy app to get many of the latest features on your older device. For instance, you can get those quick settings on your notifications, improved recent apps, or the feature to double tap recent button to switch to the previous app. Moving on, we have lock screen mod. This one is a simple module that lets you launch your favorite apps directly from your lock screen. So you may say that this option is also present on gravity box but that app is really heavy and if you don't intend to use that app to, it, to the full potential why put the extra load just to get this little tweak. On number 3 this is whatsapp x. So if you use whatsapp a lot this app is for you. This basically lets you mod your whatsapp the way you want it. Like from within whatsapp you can tap on the call button and that will place a call to that person on the phone dialer. Or you can password protect a specific chat from within WhatsApp instead of blocking the whole app. That's pretty cool, right? Next up, we have power app. So if we talk about the battery life on Android smartphones, that's the only thing that has not been improved till date. And even with a full charge, most devices won't last throughout the day. And the popular solutions like reducing screen brightness or turning off connectivity are not quite obvious. I mean, what's the use of a smartphone if you can't use it to its full potential? So here the app PowerNap comes in. It actually saves your battery when you are not using your device. You open the app and select which app can trigger wake locks. And the only whitelisted apps will be able to wake your phone from deep sleep. And those power hungry apps like Facebook, Play Services won't be able to do that when the device is sleeping. So moving on, we have awesome pop-up video. And this module will allow you place a floating window playing your video from YouTube or any other site that sources video. This just means that your multitasking got a little bit better. You can do whatever you want while your video is playing on the screen for you. You just go to the video you want. Hit the share button and select awesome pop-up video. You can pull the window wherever you want or also you can make it full screen. This is battery home icon. You see my home bat button on nav bar is that circle. That is actually my battery level if you look closely and it's dynamic. It changes depending on your current battery level. You can change the color of the circle, the thickness and also you can set it to display dynamic color depending on your current charge level. It's really cool use of your navigation bar. Now for those who always wishes to be able to zoom in those photos of Instagram, here we have a module called Zoom for Insta. This app lets you zoom into those photos and that also within the Instagram app. There are lots of lock screen apps out there but knock code is different from all. This basically replaces your lock screen with the famous knock code lock of LG. But the cool part is that you can assign different patterns to open different apps directly from your lock screen. Like you put a knock code to open your normal lock screen to home screen but you can put a specified code that will open Facebook directly from your lock screen. To finish up we have performance profile and this is a really good module if you do use resource hungry apps like photo editors or video editors and also games. This allows you to add specific profile to specific apps and lets you underclock or overclock your CPU accordingly. 
you can set both the maximum and minimum frequency for that app. This will surely affect your battery life but you will definitely see a change in the performance as well. Well that's it for this video guys. Thanks for watching and if you liked our video be sure to smash that like button and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos like it. Till next time this is Sonal signing off.